A new space station was just announced. Let me introduce you to Star Lab by NanoRax, Voyager Space, and Lockheed Martin. Well, welcome back to the Launchpad. Zach here with a TLP News update. Low Earth Orbit is scheduled now to get another space station. Let me introduce you to Star Lab, what NanoRacks, Voyager Space, and Lockheed Martin are calling Earth's first continuous crewed, free-flying commercial space station. Dedicated to conducting critical research, fostering industrial activity, and ensuring continued U.S. presence and leadership in low Earth orbit, Star Lab is expected to achieve an initial operation capability of 2027. NASA recently announced the Commercial Low Earth Orbit Destination Project, or CLD, to support the development of private space stations. The basic elements of the Star Lab space station include a large inflatable habitat designed and built by Lockheed Martin a metallic docking node, a power and propulsion element, a large robotic arm for servicing cargo and payload missions, and a state-of-the-art laboratory system to host comprehensive research, science, and manufacturing capabilities. Star Lab will be able to host up to four astronauts continuously who will be conducting the critical science and research. NanoRax recently announced also the unification of its commercial laboratory ecosystem on the ISS as the GWC Science Park. The GWC serves as the first ever in-space member of the International Association of Science Parks. Star Lab is unique as it only requires one rocket launch to deploy its entire station, and the first launch is expected in 2027. And I say first launch because if this model works, there's nothing saying that there couldn't be a fleet of these in orbits for different science. Star Lab is completely funded by private capital, and they hope that NASA will be one of the many customers. Not much more is known about Star Lab at this time, but it joins the growing list of private and commercial space stations in the development phase. Make sure to never miss another TLP news update by engaging that subscribe button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. This is Zach, signing off.